going on guys uh it's been a minute uh, i haven't been on youtube a lot i've been going pretty hardcore on the truck uh, i've been working a lot uh work's starting to slow down with the winter months so i've been i have like i'm off today so i have time to uh start this youtube video i've been wanting to do this for a while but it hasn't really been a good day outside and uh i mean it's not really a good day it's like 40 degrees today which for what it's been is pretty nice today so i'm actually filming two videos today filming the update on my truck because i have done a lot to it since the last time you guys have seen it like i mean a lot um i no longer have half of the stuff that was like almost every piece has been touched all the every mod that i've done to the truck has been touched basically um and I no longer have the Archons. Um, I got new wheels. You guys will see that I'm not gonna put them in the thumbnail. I'm gonna try to mark them out if I can. If not, oh well, you'll see them. Um, or I'll just use a picture that doesn't have the wheels in them. Who knows? That'll probably be it. Um, but it has been a minute, guys. Um, but I figured I'd go ahead and give you an update on the truck because I've done a bunch of mods to it um i'll go ahead and do a little montage of the truck and then i will come back and explain everything that we have gone through and everything we've done to the truck uh since the last time i've seen you guys which was in august i believe or september um right after i put the lift on lift right still rides great still does great the only thing i would recommend if you are a obs chevy or gmc getting a rough country lift the only thing that i would recommend is that you get um tubular upper control arms i have not got them yet um because your upper control arm will hit your shock i am working on getting those right now they're very hard to find for an obs um kryptonite doesn't even make them which i was really hoping they would but they do not sadly so um you're just gonna have to find this thing like I did uh if I can get the link I'll put it in the description for you guys for the tubular control arms that I'm going with um yeah let's go into the montage So, you guys have seen the truck. That night roller is pretty cool. Um, got that a couple days ago with a couple of my buddies. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, I've done a lot of stuff to the truck. Uh, it got, obviously, the new wheels. Yep, American Force 24 by 14. American Force Novas wrapped in 33 by 14 5 Fury MTs. Um, surprisingly, for this truck being on a rough country lift and 24s, it rides incredible. Um, so it rides amazing. Um, I couldn't be happier with it. I put, um, switchbacks in, uh, my side marker lights and my, uh, or not my side markers, my parking lights, side markers are LEDs. I cannot find switchbacks. If you guys know where a not, I think it's a 914 or 911, um, bulb side marker lights, you guys can find uh, one of those that is a switchback. Let me know um, because I do plan on eventually changing the switchback if I can find it, but I cannot. Um, I put the stock mirrors back on. Not stock mirrors; those are actual like 
uh, gloss color matched mirrors. Um, put a bed liner in it, which you guys did not see. It's got a bed mat, new tail lights. Uh, they're the Armalite, I think, tail lights. They uh, are incredible. They have the little emblem or the little LED bar in it that I like. Uh, I put a front valence on my truck. I don't know if that was on there um, when I did my lift or not. Um, I also put white tow hooks on there. Um, I don't know if that was on there when I did my lift or not. Um, uh, I put a smaller antenna on it, so it's got an antenna now. Um, I repainted the door uh, handles. Um, other than that, I haven't really done a whole lot uh, to it. Um, keeping it simple and clean. Um, I have a new tailgate for it and a new hood for it, not new, but used, that are going to get prepped, bondo, painted, you know, just regular prep, and then sent to a paint shop to get painted. Uh, so my hood will no longer have that white stuff in it. I am keeping this hood, though, because it is a little sentimental to me, uh, kind of. I, if some of you guys don't know, I actually wrecked a dirt bike into my truck, into the front of this truck. Thankfully, it did no damage to the front of the truck other than my tooth. Obviously, uh, you guys got to see that from my last video. My tooth got chipped off of the hood of my truck. So there's a giant like scratch, like an indent where my tooth went into it. So I'm gonna keep this hood. Um, I don't know, we'll see, we'll see what happens with it. Um, but yeah, the truck is turning out amazing. Um, it's going definitely the way that I want it to. So, uh, yeah. Now let's uh, switch over to me inside and not in the freezing cold. All right, so um, I wanted to come in here and talk to you guys a little bit about how I got the wheels and tires. Uh, I got them from Perfection Wheels. Uh, they're in Bloomington, Illinois. Uh, they work with you. Um, they got my wheels. I think it was like four or five weeks. Um, it was pretty quick. I mean, they had did they did custom order the wheels. Um, so it did take a while, obviously, for them. They had to make the wheels. Um, but yeah, uh, my experience there was. Uh, Excellent. Um, I got a bunch of lanyards, um, stickers. I even got a license plate. Um, this is American Force on it. Um, I've done lots of the truck. I'm very proud of where I've gotten. Um, I'm 18 years old and uh, I'm driving an OBS that's pimped the fuck out. Um, I want to continue to make videos. Um, I have a truck, I have a bunch of truck shows that I want to go to in the spring and I would love to be able to make videos for those. Uh, I think I have one April 1st. Uh, I really want to go to that one. Uh, I'm probably going to, I'm going to one May 6th. Um, that one ought to be interesting. I've heard that they're having a mobile dyno coming. Uh, that would be pretty sick. Um, I'm 100% going to film if I do go. I'm gonna try to get better at that, better at filming. Um, I, I roll up with uh, a bunch of my friends uh, in that roller that you guys saw, that nighttime roller, that uh, white uh, 1500 was my friend Colin. Uh, that truck's pretty badass. Um, it's on a three inch lift, I think, and it's a 22 by 12 Archon Caesars. I'm not sure what tires they're on. Uh, that truck's badass. It's got paint matched taillights. Uh, that truck is that truck's sick. But um, definitely gonna try to film more, uh, go to more shows, um, and just have a good time. You know, uh, I'd like to make videos more on you know the truck and uh, let you guys see it more. So that's basically it. So. See you in the next YouTube video.